So this is the next episode of Today with us we have uh, Booty Booty as our co-host Hi, glad to be here. Thank you, thank you for having me. Welcome. We didn't get the Welcome. handshake. Oh. Handshake. There we go. Hands We're gonna spice it up a bit. And later on in the show, you'll get a feature of Mimi's marble. I'll imitate Jesus. So, what did you think of Chapel today? I got a shout out for the men's varsity volleyball team. Oh uh, yes. And what what do you do on there? Uh, I'm I'm, man I'm managing uh, alongside Amy Beechnuts. Oh, speaking of Amy Beechnuts. So, uh, here's Amy Beechnuts. Amy Beechnuts. Okay, it's Beechnuts, seriously. It's Beechnuts. No, false. Oh, is it maybe koala bear? No, 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 this is definitely a false black bear Nope, case. it's a maybe koala bear. No, no. Maybe koala bear? Maybe koala bear. Oh, there's undecided not, grizzly not bear. Maybe, it's maybe. What's the difference between maybe and undecided? Okay, well, I mean, undecided is, you you know, you haven't picked yet, and then maybe it's like you're kind of leaning, you know. Yeah, as in maybe koala bear. No, as in false black bear. As in you're a hoe. Biatch, please. <laughs> Censored, we need to censor that out. Yes, yeah, so this is inappropriate for children under like 10. <laughs> so if you're not in high school, you can't watch this. Are you sure? Positive. What if they're one of those genius kids who are like five when they go to high school? No, they're, no, they're, still, they're not they're, mature they're enough. They can't handle it. I gotta go there. Oops. Okay. No. So thank you for coming on trail. Yes, thank, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Get the handshake inside the camera. Inside the camera. In the there, camera. there we go. So uh, that was Amy. Beach um. Beach nuts. Beach. And Mike Abood Riha. So what are you gonna do for uh, this weekend? Well, as boom, I'm going to maybe hit up the dance concert featuring Clara. Or how about you? How about yourself? You got anything? Uh, this weekend I got cotillion or whatever. It oh, is. cotillion. Oh, hell yeah, baby. Some people pronounce it cotillion or whatever. I say cotillion. Yeah, because it's not just one. Gotta it's got to be co. Like you gotta put the emphasis on the co. It's like co-host. You don't say co-host. You say. Co. Like caca, you say coco. Oh, so Culture Fest. Um, oh, yeah. I'm making an Australia booth. Oh, yeah, was that with the Aussie kid who plays the trumpet? Yes. Jonathan? Yep. yep. Shout out to him. Yep. Jonathan Hancock. So, are you making a booth? Yes, I am. Alongside DeBakey, Bloomfield, Miss Sarah Sawa, and the Shabanis, we're making a big Middle Eastern booth. So, uh, we have uh, David Jones right here with his fancy new haircut. You got anything spiffy doing this weekend? Um, not really. I'm gonna go to that cotillion with you, Richie. Cotillion. Or whatever home, yeah, whatever it's called. Cotillion. Cotillion. Co for the show. Or the hoe. You've got blue in your mom. I do. So I'm, I'm mainly here just to promote the, uh, the tonight, you know? ETV night. The ETV yeah. night. I don't know even oh, know yeah? what's playing. I'm just here to promote that. It's, a, it's gonna come out on DVD mm -hmm. at nice. S Cinema Brothers. Nice. On Westheimer and Durndal. And. You guys go pick that up, $45. Just come out tonight, guys. I know this is going out live to everyone on their television. <laughs> oh yeah, this is come breaking news. All of our listeners right now, they can't see this, they're blind. Yeah. If you're just listening, come out tonight, listen to my voice. 6.30, tonight, field, 6.30. But I tried to get this one that was, uh, Extraterrestrial like culture, but they won't let me do it. Just go shake out. Go yeah, shake yeah, hands tonight. Yeah. Come out this Friday. The movie opens this Friday. Uh, that, that's uh, Quantum of Solace this Friday. Come out and see it. <laughs> Starting it. Okay. Thank you so much. Good luck, David. Yeah. Thank you. Now let's go to uh, Mike's Marble Top with special host Mimi Denmon. Hello, and this is Mimi's Marble. Top. No, it's Mike. You, you, Mimi as Mike and Mike. I'm Mimi as Mike as Mar Marble Top. No, you Mimi as Mike in M Mike's Marble <laughs> Mimi Top. Mimi as Mike in Marble Top. In Mike's Marble Top. <laughs> I am continuing this segment. No one likes of... you. No one likes your mom. Okay. But continue. I am continuing the segment of 10 Things I Hate About Alex Broom. And number eight and a half. So, like he's blind. He's blonde? He's blind. Really, glasses, really blind. Uh, like, take off his glasses and then put them on, you'll get a freaking headache. Yeah. That's, that's kind of what he, it looks like. Can't really see. Wait, 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 wait. There you go. Mimi's signing out. Commercial time. So 
now we're back and we're gonna do a uh, number 10 list and our list for today is uh, what, what what's our list um how to get rid of a girl how to ditch a girl yeah get the out of here. number one all right number one fails <laughs> so let's go to number nine. number nine I like your legs they look like cheese you want a bite yeah Fail. Okay. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> well, I made things worse. Number seven. Eat a hamburger messily and you leave all the juices on your chin. Mm -hmm. Give me some of that juice. Alright, what's number six? Yeah. Well, number seven is inconclusive. Okay, let's move on to number six. <laughs> okay, number six is, uh, tell her she looks like a slut. She looks like a slut. So do you. Fail. <laughs> Okay, the fifth one is you fought in her presence. <laughs> oh, golly gee willy, Chris, I just farted. I can do better than that. <laughs> that one obviously failed. <laughs> obviously. The fourth one is pick your nose. Did you want some? <laughs> That one obviously was... failed as well, and was in fact quite disgusting. Yeah. The next one will be burp in her presence. That's so sexy. Apparently, smelling like old food that has been digested with stomach acid smells really good, and should encourage her to sleep with you. But let's go to the <laughs> second to last one. You give her a three-leaf clover and tell her it's a lovely bouquet. Baby, I got you some three-leaf clover. Oh my gosh, you shouldn't clover. have. It's my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, that's Three-leaf clovers <laughs> are, appears to be <laughs> a substantial food source for ladies of the feminine Woo. species. She didn't swallow it. Final one is you tell her you love her. Check three. She's out. Successful. Diagonal. Diagonal. Got yeah. it. Diag that this is what we did. We went for a pound, but kind of went on the angular. And we went diagonal. Like I, I would say. I grabbed. That's it. how happy we are. Is this one in your mouth? No. Yes, it is. Get rid of this crap. Okay, and that's how you get you go. Yeah. Or whatever. Yes. He's the slut I get paid. I'm the whore. Like, ah. So, what's your favorite fruit? The kiwi. Why like kiwi? They look like monkey egg. So, what's your favorite fruit, Mike? My favorite fruit is probably pineapple. Me it's... too, actually. Oh. Really? Diagonal, baby. Diagonal. Every, uh, oh, every uh, pizza I get, I make sure there's pineapples on it. Actually, I just like pineapple by itself, not really in I like pizza it on form. everything. I really don't like it on pizza either. I, I'm not the, a fan. The, the, it just doesn't blend well. Like pineapple going into an oven. Just, I mean, it's kind of like you're bringing the Hawaiian to the American. They should just stick. So you think Hawaii is in America, even though our, our newly elected president is from Hawaii. So this is the end of uh, Granny Smith podcast episode 003. I'm signing off saying boobs. <laughs> <laughs> you can... Girl, you're a scam.